so what is up guys this is my channel draw art color like share and subscribe to my channel so now moving on to this video i'm going to show you how i created my own flipbook so now i'm going to show you uh, how to trace all the pictures accordingly to create a smooth moving picture experience so now first you should uh, create several images like i have done in this video you can see it and you should create an equal spaces between them to be a accordingly smooth motion so now just by doing that uh, several times it's much as smooth you want so in this video i have created mainly three scenes so as you can see the uh, the starting scene is the back scene from where it is creating an effect of moving the camera upwards so by taking several images accordingly representing them i have created a smooth running experience so as now you can see i have created this kind of pictures where i have created uh, a total of 11 pictures and accordingly i have put them together create a smooth animation feel so now it's starting yeah, hold it tightly so as you can see my first scene is been completed so moving on to the second scene uh, which is the front scene I have done the exact same thing for it too so now in this, uh, in this scene as you can see I'm uh, equaling the pictures so that it will smoothly flow uh, through the fingers and create a good animation motion movement now you can see it is running smoothly and as fast as you want you can do it so now the scene one is completed we will put it on the back scene as you can see and now for the second scene which is the front scene front scene I have traced the face of the character which is named as Jack I have traced it and I have created three pictures to create, uh, to create a small motion as you can see in I am holding the three pictures as you can see in, in the background it is exactly the same picture and now I will hold it tightly so that it will not move out of the hand now I have created a small very small uh, motion as you can see only the smiling part is there so I'm going to show you again so it is not running exactly smooth as I want but I have done it so moving it on the side I'm going to show you the third scene, the third, which is uh, divided into two parts. I mean, the first part is the bottom part. The bottom part, I'm going to. to uh, I have done a small effect, which is displaying name and uh, and the name goes on and disappears as he moves forwards. Now you're going to see how I traced it. So first I have traced uh, uh, the uh, person's legs and then later on I create uh, I have created a background and I have traced uh, the background accordingly to create a moving background effect. So now I have created the motion along with it and now I have crea created several pictures displaying the motion of moving the person. So I have holding it tight. To, uh, give uh, is a moving picture look so now as you can see finish my scene so now I'm holding it tightly and now I'm going to show you how I, how it's done and now by releasing my fingers it will create a moving effect so as you can see the check name disappears uh, in the picture so it is quite like an introduction of the character so 
basically this is the third scene first part and for the second part I have to trace the image of his face along with his hair along with the background so I have traced it in the, uh, the second part and then I have created two pictures uh, in which which shows his journey so now so now at last the third scene is also finished as you can see I'm holding two pictures so I will put it aside and now at last my me as you can see So now I am assembling all the uh, scenes according to the page number I have given. So as you can see, I am assembling all the scenes. At first the first scene which is the back scene and then the next scene which is the front scene and the third uh, scene which is the character itself. And now it is finished. And at last, I'm going to add my own name to it. And I've cre also created a cover. If you want, you can make it too. But it is not a compulsory thing for it. So, it is finished. And as you can see, I'm holding all the scenes together. And you know, I'm holding it quite uh, adjusting it and holding it tight that our uh, pictures are on their place so as you can see I'm holding it so now at first I'm going to open the cover and I have opened it to this holding it uh, and now I'm going to show you how this done so as you can see it has done a smooth any uh, flip book and now as, mu as much as you want you can do it oh so it's done now I'm going to put it aside and please like my video and subscribe to my channel that's it hope you guys are doing well